the legacy that we were able to start with the community fund and all the support from the community of Cincinnati uh, to put all those kids through college. I appreciate that. And the Marvin Lewis Community Fund has scored big for our city, probably more than anything the longtime head coach could have done on the football field. It is beyond what happens in the field of play. It, it, it is the great man that he is and everything that he has stood for and stands for and the impact that he made here in Cincinnati and the lives that he did change here. An example of the community fund's reach, building playgrounds that will last much longer than most football players' careers. Millions of dollars in scholarships for greater Cincinnati students and inspiring thousands of young people to dream big through a project called Learning is Cool. Starting 31,000 kids with that program every year and it is set up to um, encourage kids to make the A honor roll. Dozens of area college students have received nearly $2 million to support their educational goals through the Cincinnati Scholarship Foundation and the Marvin Lewis Fund. It is a huge loss to lose that scholarship fund, um, obviously to the community and the students and to this organization. Um, it's, it's sad to see it go. We understand why he had to go. Um, we'd love to see something else come in to replace that fund. But students already promised money will not be left in the cold. There has this been has been a in the works, really, for about a year now, right? Right, absolutely. As you know, um, coaches' contracts have been up for renewal, and so there's always kind of been a plan in place of what we should do should it happen. Um, so we're just now going to execute that plan. And again, the fund will support the remaining eight students in college through 2021. You know, the hope is that another group, maybe even the Bengals organization itself, will take over the Marvin Lewis Fund and develop a similar project to benefit young people in greater Cincinnati. Let's send it back over to Mike and Sheree. All right, Curtis.